Hey, good morning. Bob Miller with a son of my, son of my his gratitude video. Today is day number 48. Now today I did something that I don't usually like to do. I tagged a whole bunch of people in the, in the early morning posts. Because what I usually do on Facebook, I'll post the person that I'm, I'm grateful for. And then, then I'll do the video a little bit later and I'll post that up after I get home and do a bunch of stuff. So this morning I tagged a whole, I tagged most of the people that, that I had mentioned that had won the award, that had not, not an award, but people that I had mentioned as people I was grateful for, like Robert Hollis, Diane Hockman, Burt Bledsoe, Mark Culberson, Rob Ford, Justin Egan, Adam Chandler, Debbie Garcia. I mean, just tons of people that, that, I, that I mentioned. And, and so I put all, I tagged the majority of those people. Some people are no longer even with us. Some people are, are not even my friends, but like Brenda Bichard, Wayne Dyer, you know, people like that. I didn't put them in because they're not going to see the tag. But the reason I did is because the person that I'm, I'm naming today is, is a young kid, 11-year-old kid named jo Josh, Joshua Rutherford. He is the son of Jennifer Rutherford. And Joshua, actually I had him and his, his, him and his mother on my radio show, The Incredible Breakthrough Show, last year. He, he, was, he was born, he had a stroke before he was born. Before he was, he came out, he came out of the womb with a hair and he already had a stroke. Now I know several people, kids, that have had that happen. And I'll probably talk more about that at a later date. But anyways, he created, he, he himself, along with his mother, but, but it was his idea, he created a thing called the Traveling Awareness Bears. And what they do, they give these, these stuffed animal bears, they send them to kids all around the world who are in a hospital with whatever. Maybe they get a, a broken leg or something. And, and so they'll, they'll put whatever the kid has, like a cast on, on the leg, and they'll send it to them just so it help them help the child feel better about being there. So it's a really cool thing that they do. It's a nonprofit. Check them out. Go to Traveling Awareness Bears. But the reason I named him today is because his, he was, he was in, a, he was in a, uh, a race right now to win this special adapt, adaptive bicycle to help him get better physically, help him get better. He's 11 years old and he's in second place right now. So in, in the video or in the post today, I put the, I put the link and asking people to to vote, you can only you can vote one time in, through Facebook, or you can use as many you can use as many emails as you want for one vote per person. And I'm hoping people will share it. I'm just hoping people will share this because he's in second place. The kid that's in first place right now is, is three years old. The bike is for a, a person, a ten year old and up. So if the, if the three year old kid, if he wins it, and you know, God bless the kid if he wins it, but he's not going to be able to use this bicycle for like another seven years or something like that. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping that Joshua wins this. He's really deserving for everything that he does, all this this, this extra work that these people have done to help other people. He's definitely deserving of this. So so if you can find it in your heart. To vote for Joshua, I'm I'm going to put the link below this video, in this video, around this video, somewhere. Vote for it, and and hopefully he'll he'll get that. But anyways, I thank you so much for doing this, and um, have yourself a great day, filled with positive momentum because you deserve another chance. And now, who are you grateful for today? I'll talk to you tomorrow on day 49. Bye bye.